2003 Yamaha, Yamaha, sorry, Honda CBR 600 RR. This bike was previously categorized as Cat N for non structural damage. Obviously, it doesn't affect your insurance. The Cat N category for this could have been anything from scratches on fairings, hello cracks, parts that are damaged by using them to repair or replace. But I've seen this video, I'm going to show you around the bike and really get a bad points about it. Starting you off, the chain and sprocket still have plenty of pullback, the rear tire have plenty of tread, alloy in very good condition. Chain guard, mud guard in good condition on the rear. Nice braided brake line for the rear brake. So the brake discs and the pads are in good condition on the rear. You see nice wheel stickers around the rear alloy. Pinion foot pegs, but the seat has been replaced with a cover. Main seat has a nice cover on it, does it really nice. RNG crash sliders on either side. Aftermarket bar ends, grips and levers, do it really nice. Aftermarket mirrors, they do have integrated LED indicators on them, but they have been disconnected. Standard side light, standard low beam and high beam, LED, uh, LED indicators all round. This side, obviously, a few minor scuffs here, and obviously, uh, a bit of a crack to the fairing there, but it's nothing major. Obviously, a little bit of wear and tear to the uh, rear fairing there. Obviously, LED color light, nice aftermarket end fan, aftermarket plate bracket. It does have an aftermarket, um, obviously, number plate light. If you would like one that is smaller, and obviously it isn't as bulky please just let us know our team will be more than happy to change it for you it does have nice aftermarket rear sets edge case on this side are clean fairings on this side are immaculate obviously just a slight little mark there nothing bad though front end is clean forks are in good condition front brake discs and pads are in excellent condition front tire has plenty of tread obviously front mud guard i don't really see any marks to it which is nice obviously it's a tiny scuff here and a little scuff to the mirror Obviously, you say the same with like the bar ends and the lever. Literally, just that mark. The tank is in good condition, does have tank protect sticker down the middle. And the here's all nice and clean. Dash does work absolutely fine with no issues on that. Obviously, do like the LED tail light, it does look really nice, looks very clean. Obviously, I mentioned about this side being already clean, very good condition. It does have the braided brake lines for the front brake as well. I've just also noticed that it has a aftermarket brake reservoir cap on the front there. Obviously standard handlebars, no uh, issues with them. It does have the, uh, obviously the radiator in good condition, standard form over there. Obviously headers do look in good condition. Just trying to see if this one has a steering dampener. It doesn't look like it does. But obviously everything works as it should. It is a very clean bike. Engine obviously does run smooth on this. Gearbox is smooth, clutch has a really good biting point. I just noticed obviously the gear selector will get on this side as well. Obviously the engine has covered just over uh, 31 and a half thousand miles. Very low mileage for one of these. We've had a lot of these come in with a lot higher mileage. But if you just look after it, it will last you a very uh, very long time. Obviously the Honda's reliability is very, very good. These bikes are very desirable, a lot of people love these. Obviously, nice fast bikes, they're very clean. They do, look, uh, they do have quite a good look to them. It is a ready to ride away bike. Obviously, you cut in for the marks and scratches and obviously the fair and damage there. Obviously, it's all bolted on nicely. 
Uh, it's not going to come off on you after riding. Very clean bike. But that'd be everything for this 2003 Honda CBR 600 Double Thank you.